In the midst about the eclipse from a health perspective in our weekend download, Dr. Jen Ashton, our chief women's health correspondent, is here. Good morning. Good morning. We've got our little sunglasses yep. handy. Um, it's worth saying one more time, your regular sunglasses are not going to cut it. Correct. They don't block that UV light. Neither do the cell phone cameras, telescopes, binoculars. This is not a joke. If you look at this solar eclipse without the proper eclipse glasses, which we have right here, you will do damage to your eyes. And I just want to let people know to tell that you're not using counterfeits when you put them on. Inside, everything will look black. That's how you know you're looking through real Eclipse safe glasses. If you look at an unfrosted light bulb, you will be able to see the wire filament with these glasses. Only on. the wire filament. Okay. Correct. So let's um, bust some myths. Yeah. Uh, what about the myth that if my eyes don't hurt, they must not be getting damaged? Absolutely incorrect because on the retina, which is the part of the eye that's at risk, if you look without the proper glasses, there are no nerve endings. There will not be any pain. The only signs or symptoms that you will have is several hours later, you'll have a central blurriness, almost like there's Vaseline in the center of your visual field. There will not be pain either when you're looking at it or afterwards, so that is really, really important. And to be clear, you can damage your vision in as little as a few seconds. Oh, wow, okay, do babies and pets need protection? Because there is the myth that they do. I know, and it would be adorable, but they don't know about the eclipse. Certainly our pets don't know, and little babies don't know. <laughs> so it's unlikely that they're gonna be staring at this eclipse. So no, they don't need protection. If you're concerned, just leave them inside. It's gonna make for some great visuals, nonetheless. Uh, and finally, there have been some myths that um, if you watch a lunar eclipse, and of course, this is a total eclipse that right. we're talking about, and a partial eclipse, not right. a lunar eclipse, two right. different things. But if you you watch a lunar eclipse when you're pregnant, your baby will be born with a cleft lip. And there are so many in incredibly interesting solar lunar eclipse kind of stories that involve obstetrics and pregnancy. We know that cleft palate, cleft lip is not related to anything that's going on in the sun or, or lunar system. So no, that is completely false. It has to do with some genetic and environmental factors, but this one, no. The sun's always out when you're, Put these on, when my you're dear. in studio with us. Dr. That's Jen, right. thank you so much, you're everybody. Welcome. Oh, I'm trying to read off the phone. I, know. I can't read these on. You can see our full coverage of the Great American Eclipse Monday with our live special starting at 1 p.m. Eastern right here on ABC. And don't forget to share your photos with us, even the ones of your babies and your pets.